Hey guys, welcome back to our channel where we explore the realm of Wondershare eDraw Mind every now and then to enhance our productivity and goal achievement. We all face scenarios where we must use time management strategies to achieve maximum productivity and enhance our task management. Now that everything operates online, managing tasks should also. Before heading into our video, let me give you a brief overview of what we are going to discuss in this video. We will understand eDraw Mind as a task management software that helps you keep everything synchronized and organized. As you have already heard, eDraw Mind v11 has been launched, so the new updates will be discussed in detail along the way. Let's start with a basic understanding of how eDraw Mind is a task management software is important and what benefits it offers to its audience. The very initial step of managing a task with an eDraw Mind task manager or any task manager is setting the goal. This refers to the outcome you expect to achieve while performing a task. Setting goals with the eDraw Mind task manager allows you to manage the main goal, sub goals, and further tasks using the mind mapping technique. For instance, in the given example, as you can see, you can assign boxes for the main goals, sub goals, and for their details. You can simply add the box for a new sub goal by pressing the tab button from your keyboard. As you can see, for instance, in the given example, you can assign up boxes for main goals, sub goals, and further details. And you can simply add the box for a new sub goal by pressing the tab button on your keyboard, as I just did with the subtopic there. This keeps your goals organized and you can see what's next on the list for you, your team, or your coworkers to go for. The next step of eDraw Mind task management is prioritization. As the name suggests, you'll have to arrange the task in a most important order, or at least important fashion to sort out priorities. This order might depend on your deadlines or the significance of the goal. With eDraw Mind's valuable assets, you can actually set color codes here as well for important tasks or add graphical references too. You can see I'm setting this up to be a different color right here, which can be done across all of these different sub goals. Once you have determined goals according to their significance, it is time to decide on deadlines or in other words, scheduling the tasks. Deadlines play an important role in task management as they motivate us to work towards our goals and set new ones. During task management, eDraw Mind, you can add timelines for each goal and sub goal to avoid delays and last minute burdens. There are many ways you can schedule your tasks in eDraw Mind Task Manager. You can also add them as a floating topic like this or a parent topic. As you can see right here, you can add that too. In addition, you can also use timelines in eDraw Mind's callout formats to enhance the prominence as well. Here, I've used a simple method, but you can also explore the task manager's options from the select form. The next step of task management in general is visualization, which means the practical progress in achieving the goals that you have set. If you are someone who prefers to keep a record of everything, you can also add the progress in eDraw Mind's task manager's mind maps using subtopics. This takes us to our last yet important task management step, collaboration. Collaborating with your teams on file management is now extremely easy and accessible via this task manager. It allows you to share task management files with your team via email or URL. You can also give them access to edit files to keep up with the progress, hence everything stays maintained. As you've gotten a brief overview of this task manager and how to manage tasks, let's dive into some recent advancements. If I had to name the simple file management system that changed my life, I'd seriously name Wondershare eDraw Mind. The software just launched its V11 upgrade, allowing users to enhance their digital organization of files and tasks. In this section of our video, we will discuss the updates and features of Wondershare eDraw Mind that made it my first choice for document management. The software offers an extensive cloud files feature where you can find all your shared projects collaborated projects and trash projects. As you can see right here, there's cloud, shared, and trash documents in the cloud document section. The next feature that it has introduced to 
Accelerate File Management is the inspiration feature. This feature uses the power of AI to help you create PowerPoints, mind maps, and outlines. Not only does it generate documents, but it also helps you with generating the content within. For instance, if I want to create a mind map here on task management for a specific purpose, I'll just add to the instructions and we'll do the magic. So in this, we can go to the workspace and then inspiration space and click on any of these. Like for example, I can click on mind map right here. As I said, not only does it generate these documents, but it also helps you with generating the content within. For instance, if I wanted to create a mind map on task management for a specific purpose, I'd add it in there and the AI will do the magic after putting in the instructions. But that's not it. This file system also allows me to edit the generated content in case it doesn't match my expectations. But I still have a pattern. The next update it introduced is multi-person collaboration, which allows you to collaborate with teams to view, edit, and digitally organize a document. I don't have to discuss this update in detail as it is discussed prior if you haven't skipped that first part. So you go to the top right, press share. As you can see here, uh, you can change this setting regarding email uh, viewer or editor's access as well as who has access to what with the link. In task managing documents, you might want to employ the same templates for future reference. If you have created a mind map presentation, or outline with the software, you can save it in eDrawMind templates for productivity. It offers a personal template feature that enables you to save your templates by custom names to utilize in the future. So you can see, you can go to the new section right here on the top left, click on personal templates, and after you press file, save as template for any of your different spaces, it'll actually make it a template. You can see it right here, file, save as, and then personal template. Put the name in there, and then you're all good to go. Now, last but not least, you can actually create outline notes with this task manager, which enables you to highlight the key points of any document, book, meeting, or more. All you have to do is go to the new section here, and then on the right, there is a new outline notes. This allows you to highlight the key points of any document, book, meeting, or more. Remember that this was just a brief introduction to these features. However, they all offer multi-personalization options, templates, clip art, graphics, and other visual settings. If you're an expert in mind mapping or would like to utilize mind maps for digital organization, this software is the best option. Its template gallery is full of mind mapping templates, of different categories and subcategories. Whether you are a project manager, a teacher, or a student, you can use eDrawMind for document management. Now next we're gonna talk about cloud files and multi-person collaboration. If you have watched the video here, you must know how Wondershare eDrawMind works. In this section, we will discuss how to build task management in eDrawMind using its cloud files functionality. This function allows you to access, organize, and edit files across multiple devices via account credentials. In the cloud file window, you'll find the four major folders. All folder will contain all your projects that will be present. Shared is where you can find the projects that someone has shared with you. The collaborated folder is where you can find the projects you have shared with your team. And in the trash, you can find and restore your deleted files. Moreover, the project management software has one gigabyte of built-in storage that you can expand on. In addition, in eDraw Cloud Disk, you can upload many types of files from your device, including images, videos, PDFs, documents, PowerPoints, and more. Now that you're familiar with this feature, here is a step-by-step -step guide to operating this project management tool. In this segment, we're gonna explain how to access these cloud files in eDrawMind Task Manager and how to utilize them in task management. After downloading and navigating towards the left side panel, locate and select the cloud files option. Let's say we wanna set names for our files so that it would be easy for us to find them in order to share, edit, or export them. For this, select any file, just like this one, right click on it, and you can change the name by clicking rename. And let's name this file, how to manage time effectively here. Hit enter and your file will be saved. Now, if you want to access this file, navigate towards the search files right here, and you can type how to manage time. You can locate the file just like that. Very simple and easy to do. You can see it's right there, how to manage time effectively. 
Now next, you can also manage and organize the files through time management strategies. For this, click here on the time to organize them in the last created or first created order. You can see this is sort of a sorting option. And lastly, you can click on size just like that and order them as well. Now, step two is actually gonna be about editing the background and style of these. The background style and theme preference differ from person to person, so you can change them via the ultimate eDraw mind setup. Here is how you can do this. So to manage the visuals in the best project management software, now let's say you wanna customize the interface and change its theme. For this, navigate to the top right corner of the files bar and click the grid mode or list mode as your preference. You can see right here, you just click on either of those and it changes the way that this formats. To customize the theme of the interface, you can click on the shirt icon from the drop down menu and select the white or dark option to change the theme as well. The next update that this project management software has introduced is the inspiration feature. This is more like a compilation of its major AI tools, AI mind map, AI PowerPoint, and AI outlines. The mind mapping and presentation features were present before and are optimized in the new update. However, the AI outline feature was recently launched to enhance personal productivity. If you find it difficult to manage your time during exams or meetings, you can save time via this outline notes feature. For instance, you're asked to take notes during a meeting and look for a way to manage your time. The eDrawMind AI can assist you in this and here are the steps to create outline notes and unlock new possibilities. Transforming it into a mind map can help with efficient workflow. Getting AI's assistance is the best time management technique that eDrawMind AI has to offer. Step one, first select the new option and select the inspiration in the respective window. From the new window, select the outline notes option or any other option to opt for something else for task management. Now you can scroll down and give certain directions in the description box. For instance, here, I'm gonna write generate an outline for team meetings. Now notes and then press go right there. Now, if you want to transform this outline into a mind map after we press go here, it is actually pretty simple. All you have to do is wait for this to load after the AI generation occurs, and then you will go to the top left corner and click on the mind map or PowerPoint options. There are a lot of text being produced, so give us a moment here. Then you can go to the top left and then grab that PowerPoint or mind map option right there. Getting AI's assistance is the best time management technique that eDrawMind has to offer. So next we're going to talk about personal templates. Let's move towards the last segment of our video, which is also one of the time management strategies that eDrawMind offers. It includes eDrawMind templates for productivity, also displayed as personal templates, as its interface. This feature manages your time as you can create and save pre-created templates for future comprehension. You can save your templates and search them easily to enhance task management. Here's the step-by-step -step guide for creating eDrawMind templates for productivity. So step one, after creating a mind map on it, navigate towards the top toolbar and click on the save the active document option. So in the new window, click on the save as option from the left side panel and then select a name for your template. So after pressing save here in the personal templates section, now, when I go to personal templates and open this up, you can see that the six thinking hats right there are is a personal template for me. So upon reaching the end of our video, we are gonna recap the content of our video. In this video, we highlighted this task management software and how it helps manage tasks. In addition, we took a look at the new updates that are launched within its V11 upgrade. Moreover, we gave our users an elaborate review and guides to using these features for better creation with eDrawMind. To benefit from these features and enhance your productivity, use eDrawMind as one of your time management strategies. You can download its latest version from our official website or click the link in the description to enjoy eDrawMind's task manager. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.